That is a revolution. That looks really wow. cool. Close your eyes. We have got a lot of very big life events what are going to be coming up. What's good, Fizz How are you guys doing? Comment one good thing about your day below in the comments. In today's video, we've got absolutely huge news. And to celebrate the huge news, which we'll tell you about in a little while, we're gonna be going out on a little bit of a shopping spree. We're gonna be going and buying an iPhone, which we're gonna be giving away to one of you guys. And there's something very special about this iPhone, which I'm super jealous of. Like, it's incredible, isn't it? We're brimming with stuff that we wanna tell you about what's going on in our life. We've got huge life updates, which we're so excited to tell you about. But let's get out, because the babies are at nursery today. That, that was the first little mini surprise, I guess. First little mini announcement is that we've yeah. actually got some childcare now. So yeah. we get some, some Zen time. I don't know no. what's going on, but shh, shh, shh. Can you hear that? That is the sound of peace. We do really miss them, guys, but they're having an amazing time. They're making loads of friends, and it's really nice to have some of our own time again because um, Kuro and Karma's energy is um, next level. They are wild, aren't they? Especially Kuro loves smashing things up. Can you notice anything different about Mia Mia's eyebrows, Fizz Fam? Yesterday, Mia Mia had our first girly time together, didn't we? Yeah. In a long really time. Good. It was nice. And I got my eyebrows um, laminated. I'm still trying to get them to look super good because when I brush them upwards, they you do need look. A bit of practice. They basically look like the microphone, the furry microphone on this camera. <laughs> but I do need a practice. But I'm really, really pleased with them, guys. It, it's that was really fun, wasn't it? Yeah. I got my eyebrows. I think it was tinted and then threaded, and yeah, I'm actually really happy. They are like quite dark, though, so I'm kind of getting like used it. to them. I kind of like it, but at the same time, I'm like, whoa, every time I, I see myself. I feel like our eyes look really blue. I feel like they're going to fade a little bit. Yeah. I don't yeah. know if I like it or not. They I feel do like make by the time they pop. fade, I'm going to have gotten used to it, and I'm going to be gutted when they fade. No, you don't be a fool here. That's what happens every time I got microblading. But when I go to the Morphis firm, I do want to pop in the blink brow bar in there, Mia. Okay. And I want to, because yesterday I got some brow gel, but I really want to get some brow gloss, because apparently if you get your eyebrows laminated, then it looks really, really good. Okay. Yeah, so I want to go and get their brow gloss from there as well. It's really fun being back in the UK and getting to go to like all the UK shops. Then you find yeah. that fun, yeah. yeah. And you want to go somewhere as well, get Yeah, I need to get um, some Vira pens, because it's always been out for Oh, yeah. so you don't want to go to all the stationary shops, don't you? Yeah. That's so cute. I need some pens, so can you get me some? Yes, yeah, sure. For my, I'm basically like a notorious list writer, aren't I, Mia? Yeah, she's oh. also a notorious pen thief. Actually, loads of you do actually ask me on Instagram, how do you do it? How do you manage to do everything you do? Well, um, I just about managed to hang in there with it, the but the it's the list. Scribble. I love writing scribbling. lists. I'll even Constantly. write on there, eat breakfast, have dinner, and then throughout the day, I'll write a new list because the other list is like... Why do you have to... I don't know, it's kind of a little bit, it's a bit obsessive, I know, but it does help to keep me that little bit much saner. Are you ready to see the beauty? You can't really see it from the front. It just looks like a normal phone. Ta-da! Wow. 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 Look at this colour. It's matching me today. So there's a mini one, or the regular one. But don't you think though, fit fab bags are getting smaller again? So would the mini yeah. one fit better in your bag? The mini one is more convenient. It's I feel like it's more comfortable cute, to hold. But yeah. I just feel like that's uh, a better one. Yeah. This is it's still gonna be too late by the time you watch this because we're already buying you the regular one. But comment down below whether you'd prefer the regular one or the mini one. Well, actually, for our next giveaway, guys, they will know that you want a mini one. This but yeah. might actually yeah. be able to fit in women's pockets. Wow. That is a revolution. Yeah. But then we would thought the pink one sounded amazing. I definitely want that phone fist fan. Yeah. So I hope you like the choice of pink. It matches your jacket, Mia, but you can't wear it. <laughs> well, okay. I can't have it, I think she's trying to say. <laughs> Do we have the iPhone for you, FizzFam, or one of you lucky FizzFam? Does that make sense? Yeah. For one of you, FizzFam. We get it. This is for you to say thank you for being such amazing supporters to us, for always having our back, for always believing in us, and just for being Aww, you. Aww, that's sweet. Oh, thank you. Sorry. I do feel quite emotional today for some reason. I think it's because the babies are with us and I, I, I miss them. Anyway, yeah. right, let's go and have a good time now, shall we? Yeah, where yeah. should we go, Mum? I feel like you're going to go off with Daddy, aren't you? Okay. And Mia's going to come with her mummy. Yeah, yeah does good. that sound good? So all you guys have to do to be in with a chance of winning this is literally just be subscribed to the channel. That is it. So it's up for one of our subscribers. We can go in the back end on YouTube and we can scroll through and we can see everybody who's subscribed and then we can randomly pick one of you guys as a winner. 
as for what this is in celebration of, comment down below right now. This isn't part of how we choose a giveaway winner, by the way, but just comment down below what you think it is that we have bought this in celebration of. And we're gonna let you know at the end of the video if we can manage to keep it to ourselves and not tell you by this point. But yeah, comment down below what you think it's in celebration of. We're at Boba Tea Place for Boba Tea. That's not what she was saying Boobah. earlier. She Boobah. kept saying Boba Tea. She was like, let's go and get some Boba Tea. Okay, it's, it's known as bubble tea, isn't it? Yeah, bubble tea, Boba Tea. Boba. Um, Right, I really want to try brown sugar yeah, bubbles. Yeah, because apparently they're really good. And I'm trying to work out if I should go for like a dirty milk tea or if I should go for one of the fruit teas. I think I'm going to go for a fruit tea, but yeah. I don't know what like... Get lychee. Lychee is delicious. Get lychee yeah. with white okay. peach. Yeah. They're popping was... bubbles and I don't... I'll go see if they I do don't know if I like them. Can I have two of the, or do you want one as well? Yeah, but I want mine with brown sugar bubbles. Oh no, I do so. as well. Okay. Can we have three dirty milk teas with the brown sugar bubbles vegan, please? Can I get um, the white peach, the rainbow bubbles, please? Thank you, mine's just survived this time. Look how amazing it looks. <laughs> We're trying to work <laughs> out how this is made. Do any of you know? If you know, comment, please. I'm very curious. I feel like it's probably all just like super glue. Or resin, isn't it? Or like resin. It's like made to look like it. But this yeah. is the one we've got, so it looks delicious. But me and Darren haven't actually tried this, have we, before? Never you're, had it. You're a virgin <laughs> just, bubble tea. You're just telling me all about it. It's tapioca. Yeah, but you said be careful when you swallow it, didn't you? Yeah, well, it's just like... Because when I had it before, hard. I was going to give some to Koa, and then I was like, wait, I probably shouldn't give like this to Koa because he's going to yeah, like, drink Koa it. Yeah, but even can swallow it. Right, this, is, this has been an ongoing issue for about 50 years. Yeah? Yeah, I have if you're a vegan, well, actually, if you're just health conscious, you have to take supplements like, you know, DHA and things like that. But Mia can't swallow tablets. No, so she can't. I do this have has been a an fear. Ongoing when thing. I, was like, I do have a fear. I'd be oh. showing off to her, I'd be like, look, Mia, I can I swallow it without any. Real ones, so don't start pouring these, Mum. You can do it without any water. I yeah. can't do that. Oh. Thank you. Nice. What? That looks really wow. cool. You get your straw, and then, ready? What? I can't wait to try my booba. That was a fail. <laughs> See, that, that is the movement of someone who can't swallow supplements. Mm, that's good. Is it good? <gasps> that's really good. Who's the movie maker? I'm a movie maker. Way better. So I said, who's the movie maker? So I'm a movie <laughs> yeah. maker. So much better than the one I tried before. This is really good. All <laughs> well, the security kegs, they felt like a, a gun <laughs> went off. Oh, I did, even did it the wrong way round. That's why I made that bangle. <laughs> it's like a really, really sweet, naughty cup of tea, isn't it, Dara? Hello. Have a good day. What did you get up to? Hi, Kama. Should I show Daddy your crown that you made? Did you make a crown? Did you have a good day? Did you celebrate the Jubilee? <laughs> Yours is big, isn't it? Did you celebrate the Jubilee, Karma? Which one is that? Karma. Who's that? Karma. Who's that? Georgie. Georgie? You mean mommy? Mommy to you. Who's the biggest? Daddy, biggest. Daddy, yeah. And who's that? Mia. Mia, yeah, clever boy. And who's that one? That one is Sienna. Sienna! <laughs> and then who's these? Daddy, daddy. Yeah, that is daddy. Who's that? Who's that little girl? That's Karma. And that and who's that little girl with long hair? It's Sienna. I feel like you recognise us more when we're like pebbles, don't you? Georgie. Georgie, yeah. Anyone who's going, kyle has got a little jacket on and I just thought that was so cute that he thought he had a little jacket on when we these little stones. But our friends got us this. Um, as a leave-in present in Costa Rica. When we left, they gave it to us. Yeah. And then our cousin got this one for Christmas. So I can't wait for when we've got a proper house to move into and we can put these up on the walls because at the moment they're just propped up on a radiator, aren't they, Koa? And they're probably going to get smashed up as well. Treat them um, with your din din, Koa. Yeah, yeah, din din. So what are you using your new pen for, Sienna? Well, um, I'm actually planning video ideas for my channel. So yes, it has been years. I'm thinking that I want to start it up again and like do videos on it again and um, I'm kind of planning them at the moment. So yeah, and by the way guys, um, quick little haul of what I got. I got this little notebook from the shop and um, from WH Smith and I also got this Parker pen. 
I know. Gosh. I know it is, isn't it? I thought I'd upgrade Sienna's pen. I wanted to get a really nice pen because when I'm writing, like trying to plan ideas and stuff, I don't know if this is just in my head, but I just feel like when I've got a really fancy pen, it makes me feel like I'm going to achieve big things. Sienna. So I was like, right, Sienna, I'm going to get you a really nice yeah, Parker pen. Sienna, I've got my eyes on that pen. No, we <laughs> bought you one as well. What, you got me oh, yeah, we haven't told her, have we? Do you want to go, go and get Mum's one? Go and get Mum's <laughs> yeah. one. Oh, sorry, no, we didn't bite her. I don't know what I'm talking about. Sorry. Did you just get me a pick or did you get me a Parker? You you, you'll have to see. Okay. She's now going to bring the surprise, all right? Because I um, used Darren's Parker pen this morning, which he's had for years. I think you got it in Dubai, didn't you? Or was it before that? You think so, yeah. And I used it up. Well, I bought a replacement ink for it. Ah, oh, well. okay then. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry about that, Darren. That's all right. Close your eyes. Okay. <gasps> oh, thank you. And it's pink, rose gold. Yeah. Wow, I feel so posh with this. Thank you. I promise I won't steal your pens anymore. Be really careful with these. Mom, they, when you take them out of the packet, they go <sighs> up in the air. Yes. These are so cool, Fizz Fam. These are fruit and veg rockets. This is a cheeky little way to get them to eat more veg. Basically, Cora and Karma eat anything. They're really, really good. But I do like them. They think these are amazing, and then they're, they're really healthy. Sienna wants them as well, don't mm. you? Yeah, they're pretty good. We have noticed since they've um, been going to nursery, they have been a lot more tired in the afternoon and really, really hungry. When they come back, they are so hungry. So they've been playing all day. Is that nice? Oh, look, Mia's getting one as well, aren't you, Mia? Still a kid. You are for another six months. I did say to me, "Shwe, can I have one?" I said, "Of course you can." I'm your I got me. I gotta so make lovely. the most out of it, haven't I? The other day, me and Mia went to Chelsea and um, we were looking around for places to eat. I was like, oh, come in here with your mummy. And she got really embarrassed because I said mummy. I was like, Mia, trust me, loads of the people around here probably call their mum's mummy. No, but it was just weird that you said it because I don't even call you mummy. So why did you call yourself mummy? You, you don't call me mummy. We need a flashback to when Mia went and Sienna went shopping for me. <laughs> And she called me mummy. Can you remember that, Fizz fam? Now where all the shops are, and mummy is gonna leave us. Well, most of the time we go. <laughs> oh, are you giving the Fizz fam Fizz some? Fizz fam. One, two, three. Clever and girl. And yeah, what colour is that? One, two, green. Yeah. This one's the colour red. Orange. Yeah. This one's the colour red, and orange, and green. Yay, colourful, aren't they? Do you have a space rocket? I don't think they do have space rockets. Oh, but they no. should definitely go. But guess what? Up. They could have. They could have an iPhone. Yeah. They could have a brand new pink iPhone. So, what's going on, Fizz Fam? What on earth are we celebrating? Why are we doing a giveaway? We have now been in the UK for a couple of months, a uh, well, few months, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And we've been really enjoying it. So you can probably guess what I'm going to say right now, which is, as we said to you in that previous video, is we weren't sure like where our hearts were going to take us, yeah. how we were going to feel. We didn't want to make any solid plans yeah. because we'd only just left Costa Rica. Costa Rica. Yeah. We still were like kind of missing it in our hearts. We felt yes. sad. I had my surgery coming up and we were kind of focusing on that. And it was still like winter time, you know, yeah. like we, we were just like, we're still like just settling in, being back here and like having loads of stuff to do. But once my operation came out of the way, I mean, you just sat down one night, didn't we? And I said, I, do you know what? I'm just not feeling going anywhere else. No. It's, and you it's said that it as thing well. thing of like absence makes the heart go fonder. Like obviously we love the UK, again if you can hear me, we just felt like we were following our hearts and we really wanted to be able to travel and explore other parts of the world and just go on new adventures. But now after being out of the UK since 28, late 2018, 2018 we yeah. left the UK. Yeah, yeah. So we've been gone for like four years we, we came back for a show though, didn't we? Yeah. We came back for that, but, like, but we haven't lived here. Like, no, no, we came back for Kona. When but we haven't like lived here, lived no, here though, No, no, we? no. We've done little And trips. to be honest, now we just really want to because it's just, it's amazing here. We love it. Yeah. And it's absolutely amazing. Yeah, I Even feel like, like the, the little, sorry if we're having to shout, this is, this is, you know what it's like when we've got we the toddlers. We did say this, we yeah. did say this. <laughs> we were like, are we going to film with them in here or should they have a bath? And they were like, no, they can't have a bath if we're not watching them. So yeah, yeah. It, here we go, we're trying our best. And then, but every time we get the camera out, Karma always wants to join in as well. Like sometimes yeah. she wants to do the TikToks and I'm like, Karma, you can't do this TikTok with us because it's got a naughty word in it. And like she gets upset. So we just feel so excited to be here. And so as a result of that, we want to start things off with a bang and yeah. just give back. So we have got a ton of planning to do now. Yeah. They're in the other room playing with me. Um, ah. Most of which is 
trying to find a house. They're obviously currently in temporary accommodation, staying in like holiday properties. Even that is very hard to come by in London. Like literally. In the summer as well. It is, yeah, it's unreal in terms, I've never known anything like this in terms of trying to find a property. So every, all the estate agents that I've been going to, et cetera, et cetera, just like the housing market is wild as it is with everything. everything like even like is, trying to buy a car or anything. I think everyone's so, no like finding it, it hard with everything mm -hmm. right yeah. now, but, I know that if we focus on it, we're going to find the perfect creation station, aren't yeah. we? Yeah. We are going to do it. I'm really excited. Yeah. And uh, we're really, really loving being in London. And like I said, oh, 100%. It's like, so I don't think good. I said it in it's like really um, good. in on Instagram. I think I said it in previous videos. But like, I just love the energy here. I love how like varied it is. And there's all quirky little areas you can go to. Like, I feel yeah. like you can never get bored being here. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're loving it. I feel we're like exploring. it really suits us all because we've done all that like countryside living in Costa Rica. Yeah. Now. We really just want the opposite to that to get to really City enjoy life. it. Yeah, and, but and like there's loads of parks it. in London though. London is yeah. a beautiful city. There's so yeah. many parks here. And um, I think it's a really good location to like go and visit all like fun places as a family. And yeah. like, yeah, we're having a great time. So we have time. got a lot of very big life events what are gonna be coming up in yeah. terms of getting a house, starting a life. It, basically English people starting a life in England yeah. again. It's gonna be I know, unusual. But I said to Dan, it's, it's like us being in a foreign country because we've been away for so long. That's why everything's such a novelty to us and why we're really enjoying but it. But I feel like if you go abroad and live in another country, you get out of your comfort zone and you really learn and grow. But one thing that can come out which we'd never expect is that you could end up really appreciating where yeah. you are from originally. Your love for your home country. Like you might leave because yeah. you're bored and you want to try something new and then you'll have one year somewhere else and then realize that actually you do belong where you come from, which is nice. Yeah. Not that I'm not saying that we don't want to travel anymore and we're not going to go on holiday and we oh, may no. not ever live abroad, but at the moment we want to kind of like be here for a while, but I think we should yeah. still go on family vacations. Maybe, yeah. I don't even I, want to do that at the moment. Honestly, no, I, just, I literally just want to be here. I've just I had, do. we've had so long away from the place that I'm just, I love it. I love just getting, even like not, I was going to say one of the bi other big, like we've got to get a house, we've got to yeah. get a car. I was going to say that as another big thing, but I'm actually really enjoying just going on foot everywhere and just yeah. really like walking I mean, walking it's the 18th loads. is going to be this year as yeah. well. It's another big thing. And I hope- Well, Karma's birthday coming up in yeah. what? About six weeks yeah. from now? Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then also, um, oh, I've got to say something. Can you remember though, when we lived in Brighton, how many times we went away? Like we went to Italy where we got engaged. We went to China, we went to Norway. Like yeah. we do do a lot. I feel like we do more we traveling LA, when we? we live in the UK, went yeah. to Tenerife. Like I think yeah. we do end up traveling more because when you've got a base, it's easier. That as one of the things when you travel around a lot, yeah. it's actually I don't know. I find that I that like you can come back to England and you can travel to other places. Yeah, yeah. that's, that's what I'm looking forward travel. to. Yeah, like so, where you go from us. So we're going on and on. No, no, that's what I'm going. You know me. I've got to try and like yeah. bring it back on focus. Yeah. So that is why we're really excited yeah. and why we wanted to celebrate and give back to you guys and give you a phone. We know you love like uh, the latest. Even we haven't got one of these model phones actually. I've got yeah, an 11. Gorgeous. I've got an 11 Pro Max. Georgie's got an 11 as well. Mia's got an 11. I These are a 13. Oh, I think wow. we should call this Penelope Pink. Okay, we'll call it Penelope <laughs> Pink. The only way, all you have to do to be in with a chance, as I said earlier, is literally just be subscribed to the channel. So you probably subscribe. If you made it this far in the video, you probably subscribe to the channel anyway. And we are able to see that. And we're going to scroll through and pick one at random. We just want to say thanks to you guys. Thanks for yeah. always being part of this journey with us. Thanks for being here for this long. For yeah. those of you that have, those of you who are new, welcome. Thanks for you thanks guys. for coming along mm -hmm. for the journey as well. And like we always but it's been, sorry to cut sorry. you off Georgia, but it's genuinely been such a like, insane adventure yeah. and now it just feels so fun to now be back here and get to start all the UK things again. And also guys, I want to say that, you know, we always use the hashtag share the smiles on Instagram and we use it on in, um, on here on YouTube. You may think that we're talking about our videos making you smile, which is true, but also guys, you make us smile as well and we really yeah. appreciate mm -hmm. having you part of our family. And with all of the chaos of having the little toddlers and all the traveling we've been doing and stuff and like my operation, but now we are definitely going to focus on making videos to make you smile and like really getting back a connection with you guys because that has been really chaotic the last yeah, few months. Yeah, we're looking months. forward to a routine. We have been on a whirlwind, so if it feels yeah. like we haven't been there for you much, we're like we've been thinking for the time. Although we have still been making loads of content on TikTok as well, if you want to check us out on there, and then also on Instagram, you can check out all the. So basically, we're going to make videos in here on all the Fizz Fridays, the Toby Tuesdays, and sometimes share the Smile Sundays. We're going to aim for the third one on Sundays, aren't we? Yeah. But we're always going to guarantee you're going to have those. I thought we were going to say that we were going to do random days, so we did 
didn't have to delay when we published videos. I know, but now I feel like we we really missed in the Toby Tuesday yeah, schedule, true, don't we? True, we really yeah. missed that. Sorry. Yeah, guys. we did like, also it keeps us on track. It like gives us yeah. something to aim towards as well. But then we're always going to try and make daily TikToks as much as we can. We're always post some reels as well and shorts as well because we've got the Family Fizz Clips channel. Yeah. And also we're going to do any behind the scenes on our stories and Sienna wants to start her own channel. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Like I really want to use the babies going to nursery and like being in England and being like kind of settled in our home country to actually like just get back on track with everything yeah because yeah. I feel really good now I've had my operation and it's now yeah. the summer as well and the summer holidays yeah. which is exciting coming up so yeah so thank Loads you all for being up. part of the Fizz fan. thank you for being part of this community yeah. we see your comments we just love it it makes us feel uplifted to see all this support and appreciation how yeah. nice you guys are to each other and we're just really proud of the community and subscribe if you haven't yeah. yet and get ready for the new adventures in the UK. Yeah, and we can't wait. We're also going to keep you updated on like where when we find a place to live and we're going to obviously give you a house tour of the creation yeah. station. Of course. Loads of fun stuff are coming up. Comment for that. below what you want to see from us in the UK as well. Yeah, yeah, we'd love that. Give us loads of ideas of where we should go. And yeah. like, yes, thank you for saying that we should do TikTok number two, secret locations. I yeah. do oh, yeah. do that. Sienna oh, loved that, yes. didn't you? <laughs> Um, we love you so much guys um, thank you for being part of the journey and yeah we're going to keep saying it we love you guys so much and we'll see you in our next video see you in the next stay one stay fizzy bye, bye. bye.